This is a 23 gauge vitrectomy setup. The initial step is to take the infusion cannula out, prime it with oil, and put it back. The photograph insert shows the rest of the setup with the active extrusion and the light pipe inserted through the superior trockers. The diagram shows the vitreous cavity flows at the beginning of the exchange. It's important to first aspirate the BSS layer on top of the PFCL before moving to aspirate the perforocolon liquid as shown in the diagram. After removing the BSS layer, PFCL is aspirated as the silicon oil is injected in the eye, as shown here, mainly at the edge of the retinal tear. When this is achieved and the edges of the retinal tears are stuck down flat on the choroid, one follows the meniscus backward over the optic nerve to remove the rest of the uh, peripheral carbon liquid as shown here. The vitreous cavity is not overpressurized in this uh, method of exchange. Here we show the machine parameters alongside with the surgery as the injection maximum is reached, which is 30 in this case. Further pressing the pedal down will result in maintaining the maximum injection as well as linear activation of aspiration uh, of the peripheral carbon liquid.